Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Yumi Harayono. Probably butchered that to all hell. A game by Sorari Humiha. Probably butchered that to all hell as well. Doesn't matter, does it? This is a game right off the press. This is this is like cutting edge shit. This doesn't even have like a fucking fan games page, as far as I know. At least from my brief research of spending about five minutes looking at it. Um, brand new, as far as I know. Uh, I know very little about it beyond that it looked cool in a screenshot, so that's that's really the, the qualifications we're going on here. Um, one thing I have noticed from my little bits of testing is that trying to save the game not a great idea. So we're actually we're going to refrain from interacting with too much in this room because uh, I don't feel like crashing the game or getting locked up. I don't I don't really feel like that at the moment. It's late. Can't be too loud. Need to keep my voice down. This is a fucking nice. Outlook, isn't it? It's very pretty. Very urban. Keeping with the theme of uh, fan game characters having blue hair, this young heterochromatic character has blue hair. Good. Let's get into the dream world. Uh, so this is something I wanted to, to do for a little bit, but we're also just going to move my mouse cursor a bit, um, taking part in a I'm a, I'm a guinea pig here. I'm guinea pigging myself in order to in order to, you know, look at whatever that was. Very nice. Let's have a wee, wee poke about here. Any of these things going to do anything interesting? I guess it's not going to pull its punches about being a derivative work. This is looking incredibly fan gamey. We can just approach this as if I'm doing kind of a an initial impression sort of thing. Um, as I said, my primary purpose with this is to test out a potential new way of recording stuff. That's the idea anyway. Hey, look, it's a little cat thing for the cat to play in. Come here, cat. Cat doesn't want to talk to us, that's fine. Our hair kind of looks like a ghost wiggling about. Look at that. Isn't that something? Oh, hey, what's this? Another animal of some kind? A little doggy, perhaps? It's kind of small. Oh, that ghost thing is kind of difficult not to notice now. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, so I'm I'm trying out a new recording mechanism, which is handy because I'm not at home at the moment, and one of the problems with not being at home is I tried to make sure I could do all my Let's Plays and stuff on the fly. Um, but in typical me fashion... Good. We've got an effect already. See, I... I kind of know what the intent of that is, but I'm not going to say it because I'm probably just going to make a fool of myself. Good. Good. What does this do? Can we use something? Do we have a effect, maybe? I don't know really what's happening here. The music's pretty chirpy, at least. Um, yes, I, I potentially revolutionised and I mean that with all sincerity, the way I record my stuff. Which is fucking exciting. In theory, it's going to mean the whole process of me outputting this wonderful content is going to be more streamlined, and thus I can do it quicker and easier. In theory. There's obviously things I need to sort out with it. I may make a video at some point. I know one person, once upon a time, asked how do you record video games? And I was all... Record video games? You don't want to do that, mate. You don't want to do that. She seems to keep stopping. Hey, look, there's a cat in that one. Can we use our, our fun effect on it? Doesn't seem like it. I'm going to call you Ghost here. Ghost here... Jen. Ghost Air Chan, that sounds pretty good, doesn't it? Okay, so I think 
we've got the general gist of cat tree. That's what they're called, isn't it? They're like cat trees. I think the cat trees are the ones they scratch, not not just like a. Maybe we should try. Yeah, if, if that does anything, the cat's not interested at all. And I can see we've just done essentially the grand circle. Um, yes, more content. Easier for me to, to put stuff up means more content and more fun and less fannying about. But I might, I might make a video that recaps it because I know somebody did ask once upon a time how do I record my stuff. It's not particularly interesting. You certainly don't want to... I wouldn't recommend anyone to do it the way that I typically do it. I do it that way because I like being able to um, master the audio channel separately. Um, and most recording solutions, certainly up until now, do not make that too straightforward. But, yes, part of what I've done in theory fixes that. Feeling kind of like a cat at the moment. The cat is definitely out of the bag. This cat area. Is it just fucking random? We seem to be coming across just shit. I don't have any point of reference at all. Uh, right, okay, you've got 10 seconds to show me the way back out here. Or we're just gonna. We're gonna use whatever bestowed means of waking ourselves up. Yep. Somehow I knew that we would be able to pinch her cheek if I did that. It's not because I can read Japanese, it's because um, this looks pretty pretty standard fare, really, in terms of fan games. But that's fine. The art style's nice. I like um, Ghost Here Chan's hair. It's very nice. Kind of wish I had spooky hair like that. Then this is an original area design right here. Definitely original. The music's okay. It doesn't look quite right. It's important to remember this is like the first release of this game from what I understand, so we should perhaps not be too critical of some aspects of it. That movement is driving me bananas. I don't know if it's maybe because of this keyboard I'm using. It wouldn't surprise me, but it, it could just be anything. It could just be the way this game works. I would be surprised. I mean, it's fucking RPG Maker. It should work pretty standard across everything, right? In theory. You would, you would think so. Hey, what's that? Is it another effect? It is indeed. I uh, don't know what that means. It's got a line. Lines are good. Makes it rain. Oh, that's like a little raincoat. I guess. Doesn't change the, the ghost here. She didn't change, did she? Maybe we can still... I guess she did. Okay, I, I don't even know if that effect had any visual change then. Whatever's going on here, we need the super fast transport mechanism that is so familiar to these fan games. And then we can we can just fly. Fly un untoward, un unhindered on our adventures. Hmm. Hmm, this isn't doing it for me either. Nope. Nope. Looking at we're gonna keep the pace up because I, I don't wanna mumble about in these stupid areas. Besides, we're we're doing this mainly as a test, right? Mainly as an experiment into how how gullible you are into watching this crap. This door looks interesting, it's got a pair of fucking eyeballs on it. Uh, okay, so it's kinda dark. Spoopy. It's very dark. Oh, an eyeball. Mm-hmm. You know it's fan game territory when you've got the eyes going on. Lots of eyes. It's cool. Cool kind of ambience in here, though. 
touch dark, perhaps, but what are these things? It's a uh, a uh, big pile of um, it's a big pile of nothing. I guess that's okay. That's the door we came in. Who's this area? It's not fucking massive, it seems. I'm a fan of that. What's going on with this? Looks kind of like some kind of pastry. No, no, it doesn't actually. I don't know what I'm talking about. Pastry? Nah. Nah. Come on, keep just go. Come on. Maybe the arrow keys on this keyboard are, like, worn out. Maybe that's what's going on. These eyeballs look weird. Oh. Spoopy white door. Let's give it a shot. And we've emerged into flow world. Uh, that walk looks a little bit peculiar. Yeah, the first door we come in. Why not? Oh, we can't go in that door. Fair enough. Fair enough, ghost hair, Chen. We don't need to go in there. We're too good for it anyway. I'm sure whatever else is going on around here, much more to our liking. I already like you. You are pretty, pretty cool for a protagonist. Anyone with uh, the boat light style eyes is going to be my friend. Anything with uh, odd colored eyes, definitely going to. Another effect. We're, we're just acing this already. What did we get? Oh, great. We're already a furry. Maybe that's quite a cool little um, sprite, though. But what does it do for us? That big, massive cat is gone forever now. So it cat's over. Let's go down here. long white corridor that we're in. There can only be good things at the... oh fuck. There can only be good things at the end, right? Like whatever this is. What is it? Stairs, I guess. No, don't do it! Oh. Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. I didn't expect that to happen. <laughs> Whoops. Ah, <laughs> uh, I guess we died. Guess we died. Okay. Whoops. I'm sorry, ghost here, Chen. I, I didn't mean it. I did kind of instruct you to do it, but I didn't expect that to happen. Fucking hell. loud all of a sudden with this music. But it's cool. This is cool song. I wonder where they, they get their audio from. If, if they just nick it or if it's the... Is this another effect? Holy fuck. That's not okay, good. A vial. A vital vial. Transparent, good. Well, okay, vials are good. This background has a very obvious repeatingness to it. Hey, look, there's little marbles in there. We got another effect. Who is the fucking man? I recognise some of that as well, but. So. What? We just fucking spat some shit on the ground. You fucking little toe rag! How could you do that? Just, just fucking, just fucking dump stuff on the floor. Ugh! Wow. What a bitch! Oh no! Turn it off. Turn off the rain. Turn off the rain. Of course, I, I try a lot of these fan games out, and I go, yeah, yeah, a fan game, yeah. Oh, I, I say that a lot of the fan games I've tried out have been pretty bobbins. This is at least trying to be something. Perhaps a, a shallow imitation of Yuminiki, but... That's okay. If they do it right, 
If you're going to do that, you do it well. That's fine. Yeah, you can, you can do that. I would play that. For a while, anyway. So what, what else is going on in this autumn looking world? What's that? Another effect, wow. This is just effect. Oh, maniac. Oh, brilliant. Well, we're not going faster in this thing. Oh, we're in a pot. The animations are really nice. The walking left and right isn't possibly the strongest um, animation. Near as the ghost here, but that little getting in and out of the pot thing was quite nice. We seem to be just thundering, just getting effects, so I don't know if that's good. Indicative of progress. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, we'll keep the momentum up. I'm not gonna stray too deep in these areas because they might ultimately be fruitless. Fruitless. Yeah, this door seems like a sound choice. Oh, Jesus Christ. Obligatory neon -y world. Fucking lo love the green now. It gives it a little bit less intenseness than. It does another. One of the areas I really miss in um, Yumi Tiki is the. You know how they, they had the old neon hell area? The neon basement, or what it was called. Um, and they took it out. I don't think it's there in the game accessible anymore, because when you go there, it takes you to that stupid bit with all the pillars. Everything has this kind of chilled out vibe to it. I, I, I do like this, yeah. This is this is already warming to me. Oh, don't block me in, you dicks. Fuck off. Of course, I'd like it more if it had, if it had a substantially obvious gimmick that I could go up and touch. But hey, that's okay. We can approach those things as and when we we need to approaching the matter of how we're going to save our game there is going to be a tricky one because you can't exit the fucking save thing uh, that's the door we came in I believe so okay done a, done a lap oh god they keep moving in like twos and just blocking my path that combined with dodgy arrow input it's either the fault of the, this game or the keyboard. Not uh, encouraging me too much. Come on, you guys. Just, just point me in the general direction of the gimmick. And I'll be out of your hair immediately. Immediately and as long as it takes me to get to the gimmick. Figure out what it is and trigger it. Oh, that's noisy. No, no, it's too late at night for that. That kind of shenanigan. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, if I sound a bit weird, it's because I'm trying to keep my voice down. Lord knows I am prone to receiving complaints. Oh, look at you! Another effect! Holy shit, this game just like, just giving effects to everybody. Oh wow, look at us, we got like a fucking... Oh, they make little noises. Cool. Can we... What can we do with this then? I thought for a second we were moving quicker, but I don't think we are. Disappointing much. Hmm. No, fuck off. Well, we got the effect. We've got an effect just about every fucking place we've gone in this, this game so far. Which I guess is good if you... Oh, A door. <gasps> Subway garage, yes. Holy... Christ. Fucking... This is the London Underground in the morning. All of this shit. All of this fucking... Trying to fight your way through all these people. Awful. Awful. And you just want to kill them all. With a fucking... Oh. We didn't really get much chance to react to that. 
What? Jesus, what's this music? Another effect. Uh, excellent. What effect was that? Then? No, it wasn't that. It was this one. Oh, hey, look, we are past her now. How do we get out? I guess we're fucking stuck in here then, aren't we? Very tense music, considering how little is actually happening on the screen. Okay, well, I guess we're fucking waking up then. Okay. We'll do one more area. We'll do one more area, because... I'm having fun. I can do that. I'm a fucking boss after all. So I say we're going to do one more area. Yes. This one. Oh, we should equip that effect, shouldn't we? Maybe we're not fast. Maybe I'm just making that up. This sounds like the kind of thing I would make up. <clears throat> So we got rushed by something, it kills us pretty quickly. I assume it killed us, it's kind of ambiguous. It just rushed us and next thing we knew we were stuck in a room with an effect giver. Not an affection giver, because that would have been nice. Hmm, so we've got the best kind of Tiberium. No, it's not Tiberium actually, I'm thinking of Red Alert. Red Alert had the gems, didn't it? You, know, you got the ore, and then you had the gems, which give you extra, extra wongas. The background here is a little, little simplistic, perhaps. Just seems to be that thing. But there's not a lot else happening. This is the game's way of saying you should have just fucking left it, mate. You got fragged. You should have just. Quit the game. Yeah, that's the way we came in. Excellent. Excellent. And a whole lot of nothing else, really. This is a shame. Come on, game, you can you can do this this one kindness to me. I know you can. Just, just give me something. Give me something for the fans. Give me something for the dedicated. People who are dedicated to is it an effect maybe on this? It isn't. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Holy fuck. The dodgy movement makes that all the more threatening. Hey look, it's a thing. Hey there, thing. We got an effect. It's easy to identify because it has an H at the end. That would be this one. Good. We have a... <laughs> we have a that. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. God damn it. Stop chasing me. We need to get out of here with our stupid jar head. In one piece. How do we get out of here? No. 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 I don't want to go back that way. There's got to be something else to do, right? Oh shit. RPG Maker AI, the easiest AI to just outrun by running at a straight line because they will randomly move and let you get away from them. Alright, okay, come on, just just fucking eat me, do what you want. This is our prison. We're just stuck in the middle of a bunch of gems, a bunch of crystal formations that are bright red. Um, okay, fair enough. I feel like we've done alright. We've got like fucking eight effects and we've just been potting about randomly. Um, nine effects going to that. No, it's not. Yeah, eight effects. Okay. Well, there you go. Yumi Hamayono. I guess we're gonna, we're gonna pronounce it like that. Um, considering what it is, just being essentially kind of a derivative of Yumi Niki, I wasn't too offended by that. It was Pretty good fun, actually. I uh, might need to come back to it and try a little bit more. Um, but the, the proof will be in the pudding, as they say, because, as I said at the start, this is really just an experiment, so... This may never even see the light of day. It was awful. 
probably the laptop fan whirring away is going to make it pain in the arse to edit, but hey, you don't need to worry about that. I do. I'm going to worry about it on your behalf. So, um, yeah. Can we save? We can save at least, but yeah, we can't actually get out of the... I'm bashing every key, it doesn't work. Um, yeah, okay. Thanks for watching then. Good night and good luck.